Taylor Swift's private jet landed in Miami, Florida on Wednesday afternoon, October 16. Swift has been back to work after spending more than a week with her boyfriend Travis Kelsey in New York City, now she's back with her Eras tour, which starts in two days at Hard Rock Stadium. After Swift and boyfriend Travis made a surprise appearance at the first game of the AL Championship game between the Yankees and the Guardians, the global superstar is now back at center stage, from October 18 to 20. The Blank Space singer will continue her record breaking Eras tour with special guest Gracie Abrams at Hard Rock Stadium, Miami, Florida. She arrived in Miami two days in advance for three shows in the city where she is expected to do sound and lighting checks and have a rehearsal at Hard Rock Stadium before the show begins. The three shows are Swift's first since her performance at London's Wembley Stadium in mid-August and kick off the final leg of her extensive international tour. On Wednesday morning as Taylor boarded a plane to depart New York City, Travis released his podcast New Heights with his brother Jason and guest Pat McAfee. The 35-year-old chief star has been detailing his crazy Life with girlfriend Taylor Swift, specifically talking about the dream of meeting so many A-list celebrities, the NFL star has been dating Taylor Swift for over a year and is enjoying the perks that come with a high-profile relationship. Including more celebrity interactions. You can't comprehend what's going on right now, so it's like a dream, Travis, who was recently spotted out to dinner with Deadpool star Ryan Reynolds and his wife Blake Lively, admitted. You're not surprised by the next thing that comes into your life or the person that walks through the door. The grotesquery star noted that he doesn't take any of his blessings for granted, it's crazy. It's crazy, he shared. I don't know how I live this stupid fucking life, but I'm definitely blessed. The NFL star echoed this sentiment in an interview with Nat FL earlier this month, it's a fun, fun life, the athlete gushed. I can't complain about anything here. And when it comes to his plans for the future. Travis isn't limiting himself, sharing that I'm open to anything. After starring in Ryan Murphy's Grotesquery, which was filmed during the Chiefs off-season, Travis added that he would like to get a little more involved in the acting world in the future, that it was an interesting change of pace to pre-record a show after Travis's experience on the pitch. That's the most important thing he said, in my world, football is 100% live all the time.